Welcome back to Fox News Saturday night. Let's face it, Santa has a tough job this time of year. Between making all the toys and flying around the world, he barely has time to sit in a mall with bratty kids in his lap. Or does he? Joining us from the North Pole is Santa Claus himself. Hey there, Santa. <laughs> Well, hello, Tom. How are you? It is great to see you. I'm in the Christmas spirit, and I'm so happy but a little nervous to be talking to Santa. Well, it's not to be too nervous. I mean, little kids are nervous, but you're a, you're a big kid. Yeah, but I, I still haven't made my list this year, so, you know. Uh, Santa, I want to show you something. I have your calendar printed out here, and you are a very busy guy. I see here this is your Fox News appearance on the schedule here, and yep. then we have Christmas here. Uh -huh. But you have three or four appointments a day until Christmas Day. So how do you fit it all in? Well, Santa, Santa's responsibility is to, you know, take care of helping children, you know, making them happy, checking on who's naughty and nice, and that's a big job. Four times a year i got to check on everybody. Uh, but uh, in the meantime, I do get to visit a lot of places. Of course, uh, doing the tree lighting at Fox Square and then uh, things at the Stock Exchange. I've been to Nashville, Grand Ole Opry. I went to Maui to visit the fire victims. And now I get to visit with you. It's fantastic. Santa, i got to ask, are, did you pull your sleigh over to get some gas or something? It looks like you're at a fill-up station. <laughs> well, yeah, I, I had to drop in somewhere. You know, we have to... Actually, the reindeer are getting ready for the season. You know, yeah. it's, a, it's time for the reindeer games and everything. So I have the alternative sleigh here, you know, a little bit of uh, lights and uh, fancy stuff here. Yeah. And, I of course, I have an escort over. here from the police. No, no, that's my escort. Oh, okay. I have two, two, two units here that escort me around to take care of, make sure I can get to every place that Santa is needed. Well, Santa, during the Christmas season, I know you do a lot of parties and you do a lot of corporate events and things like that. So I found out that you have a handy hint for a visit from Santa. I thought this was very interesting because people don't realize when Santa's coming to visit, they have to prepare. So this was interesting. Reserve a special parking space for Santa. And remember, Santa is a senior citizen. So you, <laughs> you need a little help sometimes well, I... getting in the house, right? Well, it makes it a little easier if, if, if I am near the, uh, you know, the, the house that I'm going to visit, that I can get in easily and get, you know, get out quickly. You know, if I have to hike up the street, it takes a little bit longer. So, you know, and sometimes the, the area is filled with cars and the reindeer don't know where to park. And so we have to walk a little bit. So if they can reserve a space for the reindeer and myself, it makes it a lot easier. Uh, number six here says, have a sturdy chair for Santa to sit in. Something tells me you might have made a crash landing at some point. Is that what happened? Well, you know, sometimes you go to a visit a family and they give you a nice folding chair, which is great for Santa. But then I, if I have to put, you know, two children in my lap, all of a sudden uh, we're at critical mass. <laughs> oh, yeah. You know, the chair, the, the legs might disappear out of the chair. Yeah, that's true. Uh, so how about this one? Best photos are taken within the first 15 seconds. Now, that seems like you don't have much time to get the photo done, right? Well, it, we say that because sometimes the baby is a little nervous, you know, doesn't want to uh, get near Santa. So, again, if we can get that child on Santa's knee and get that picture very quickly before the baby knows what's going on, then we get a good picture and a smile. That's great. And would you say that what you know what was the worst? Uh, what's the worst situation you ever had with a kid? Do you ever find kids they're just not in the Christmas spirit? No. Well, you do have children that cry. You do have children that are totally afraid of you. That you know, uh, you know, you know, scream and, and flail their arms around. And what surprises me is some parents want the picture, the traumatic picture of that child crying. The parents want the picture. They love it. I got plenty uh, of them, Santa. I, there's, there's pictures of me <laughs> sitting there bawling in Santa's lap. Well, Santa, I know you're so busy, and you got to get back to your sleigh, and you got to feed the reindeer. Thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule and talking with us. And I want to let you know you're on the good list. Thank you, Santa. Uh, ham radio. You're welcome, Tom. Yeah, yeah ham radio <laughs> this year. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Thank Merry you, Christmas, Santa. everybody. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News' YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.